In education coverage here at 9 on the Z, SPS may try again to fund some projects the district needs. The Community Task Force for Public Schools and Springfield Facilities has now finished the final draft of ideas to give to the school board tomorrow. Our Frances Lynn was at their meeting a few hours ago. She tells us now what their main proposal is. Frances. David, the main point of the community task force's recommendations is an 18 cent levy increase next year to fund nine important projects. David Hall, co chair of the task force, says they ultimately decided on an 18 cent levy increase instead of 24 cents, which the school district asked for last April and voters shot down. We reduced that down because that was something that there was concern by the voters is that it was uh, more than what they were willing to accept. The money will be used to fund nine projects, which would include a renovation of a high school, renovation of a, a replacement of a middle school, and then uh, either renovation or new uh, elementary schools to go with that. Five of those, and then an early childhood center and an early childhood mini hub. So it kind of hits all the ranges and it sets the stage for additional projects in the future. The reason the group behind this plan is called a community task force is because it's a special group that's put together with a broad cross section of the community. It's not any specific group, instead, people who represent the community. What we wanted to come out with the task force is something that the whole community can get behind. And that includes high school students. I would like to see equal facilities throughout the entire district because the difference between some buildings and others can make a huge difference on the learning capabilities of other students. Senior Devin Rathbun explains the importance of a well-maintained facility. You're not focused on something else like the heat not working or the air conditioning not working. You're just focused on learning and you've got the same every classroom's the same. You know what you have to deal with and you don't have any outside distractions. Many of these you know, are from the 1920s and 1930s, so we're really trying to make sure is let's get those caught up and get them to where that we can provide a safe and secure learning environment. Task force members will present the final report tomorrow night at the regularly scheduled board meeting at 5.30. The plans and the proposed 18 cent levy are just recommendations. The board will be the ones to approve the ideas. 